Hey guys, in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can set up your crypto.com DeFi wallet. So the first step is to actually install the DeFi wallet app, which we're gonna to need to go to our app store. So if you're on iPhone, you wanna to go to the app store. If you're on Android, you wanna to go to the Google Play store. So I'm gonna go ahead and open that up right now. And what you wanna search for is DeFi wallet. And hopefully you'll see a crypto.com DeFi wallet application show up in your app app store you want to go ahead and install that by clicking on install or if you're on iphone get next let's open up the DeFi wallet app we're going to get this welcome screen and we have two options here we can either create a brand new wallet or we can import an existing wallet and all we have to do for that is just enter in our wallet phrase for this tutorial i'm just going to create a brand new wallet next we need to look over the terms of service as well as the privacy notice and once we've read those both we can go ahead and click on the check mark box here and click on continue and now we're going to get to the security part of our wallet so we need to go ahead and create a passcode for our wallet and all that's going to be is a six digit code that you're going to enter so just make sure that you remember the six digit code that you're entering because you're going to need this to log into your wallet and you can also enable face id and two-factor authentication as well if you're on android you can enable biometrics which is basically a fingerprint scan to unlock your wallet so i'm going to go ahead and enable this and we can also add the two-factor authentication if we want i'm going to go ahead and click on done and next we're going to need to set up our recovery phrase so if you're brand Brand new to crypto wallets a recovery phrase is basically a phrase that we need to remember in order to regain access to our wallets if we ever forget our passcode you want to make sure that you keep this phrase written down somewhere and kept safe because if you lose it you'll never get your assets back because crypto.com does not keep a copy of your phrase so this is very important you want to keep this written down somewhere safe where you won't lose it and you want to make sure that you share this with nobody because this is going to allow you to to recover your wallet if you ever lose access to it. All right, so basically to set up our recovery phrase, we're gonna have 12 different words, which is basically going to be our phrase that we need to remember. So let's go ahead and click on reveal my recovery phrase. So the next step is to write down our recovery phrase. And basically we got 12 words in our recovery phrase. So let's just go through the arrow and make sure that we are writing down each one of these recovery phrases as we go through each of them. And you also want to make sure that you're writing these down in the correct order because the order in which you enter these phrases do matter so let's go ahead and click on continue when we've written them down correctly and then now it's going to ask us to enter in the words that corresponded to the number on our recovery phrase now after we have done that we can name our wallet so i'm just going to call this my crypto wallet and i'm going to click on continue and now you can select an avatar for your wallet so you can select anything this is just for fun so i'm just going to go ahead and select this avatar and then it's just going to ask us to confirm our avatar and wallet name let's go ahead and click on continue once we have completed that setup we are now on the crypto wallet homepage. this is where we can send and receive crypto as well as buy crypto if we hook our wallet up to our crypto.com account we can view the crypto that we currently have in our wallet as well as go down to the earn button here where we can do things such as staking our crypto so i hope this video helped you out if it did please leave a like but that's going to do it for this video thanks so much for watching and i will see you next time